Rosie was once a much-loved riding pony. When her family outgrew her, she was sold to a dealer who promised to find her another loving home. But that's not what happened. As she grew older, she had to stop being ridden as her feet became painful. So her owners decided to make money by breeding from her instead. After giving birth to several foals, Rosie was no longer profitable to her breeders and was sold at market. She was crammed onto a transporter with other scared and unfamiliar horses that would kick and bite as they fought for space. They were swapped onto a different lorry to be exported illegally. Using falsified paperwork and a carefully planned route, Rosie's smugglers felt confident they could cover their tracks. The conditions were horrific. The floor was slick with urine and muck, with little straw and no food or water. Rosie found herself amongst horses that were pregnant, elderly and diseased. After days of restless travelling over land and sea, Rosie was exhausted and her feet caused her great pain. She collapsed but was dragged to her feet by brutal hands. Because she had been signed out of the food chain, they implanted her with a new microchip. 17-year-old Rosie became 10-year-old Hilda and with a passport to match, she was taken away, perhaps to a slaughterhouse or a fate much worse. Together we can help horses like Rosie who are cruelly used as commodities and sold for a purpose they are not fit for. Visit worldhorsewelfare.org